Jacob saw the vision in a dream in Bethel. Moses saw the vision on a mountain to tell. David saw the vision of the holy temple. Ezekiel saw the vision of the house. Then John saw the vision of the new Jerusalem. Well, it's God dispensed and God built into man. We need a vision, so we open to the Lord, seeking revelation in the Holy Word, turning to the Spirit for the building of the church. The church is the fullness of the one. Zachariah's vision was for God's recovery. Daniel had a vision of Christ in victory. Paul and Peter's vision of the building of the body complete the revelation of the age. Then John saw the vision of the new Jerusalem. Well, it's God dispensed and God built into man. We need a vision, so we open to the Lord, seeking revelation in the Holy Word, turning to the Spirit for the building of the church. The church is the fullness of the one. Jacob saw the vision in a dream in Bethel. Moses saw the vision on a mountain to tell. David saw the vision of the holy temple. Ezekiel saw the vision of the house. Then John saw the vision of the new Jerusalem. Well, it's God dispensed and God built into men. We need a vision, so we open to the Lord, seeking revelation in the Holy Word, turning to the Spirit for the building of the church. The church is the fullness of the one. Zechariah's vision was for God's recovery. Daniel had a vision of Christ in victory. Paul and Peter's vision of the building of the body complete the revelation of the age. Then John saw the vision of the new Jerusalem. Well, it's God dispensed and God built into man. We need a vision, so we open to the Lord, seeking revelation in the Holy Word, turning to the Spirit for the building of the church. The church is the fullness of the one. Then John saw the vision of the new Jerusalem. Well, it's God dispensed and God built into man. We need a vision, so we open to the Lord, seeking revelation in the Holy Word, turning to the Spirit for the building of the church. The church is the fullness of the one. Ephesians 1.23